yo yo what's up to my class and here's another edition of your lane vision uh, Python anywhere we're gonna do a little bit of functions here so the first thing that you guys gotta do so what I want you guys to do is I want you to make sure that you follow along with what I'm doing because you gotta turn this in so whatever I do then you gotta do okay so first thing you're gonna do is once you're in Python anywhere is you're gonna click on files and then you are going to create a new file. Now, first thing we're going to do is we're just going to call it um, functions. You just call it functions practice. And make sure that you add a .py. So whenever you make a new file here in Python anywhere, you got to make a .py file. New file. All right. So this is how it's going to be. What we're going to do is we are going to first create a variable. And we're just going to do a real simple function, just real simple, real simple math thing. So we're going to create a variable, and we're just going to call it number. All right. And it's going to equal um, input. And we are going to do um, enter a number. Okay. And what we're going to do is we're going to copy this. We're going to make a new line. We're going to paste it. We are going to change this, change this to number two, and we're going to say enter another number. All right. So that's just a real quick way. If you got to make two inputs, uh, remember one equal sign for an input, and you got to make sure that you spell input right, and you can put any string uh, to say what you need to say. All right. So for a function, first thing you got to do is do def. All right. Now the recommendation here is that you name your function based on what you're doing. We're going to add stuff, so we're going to do call this added. All right, with an extra D, because why not? It's lane vision. We go. We live a little on the edge. We live a little crazy. All right. And here in the parentheses, if you are going to have things come in to the function, we need to have a representation, like a variable. And these are called. These are called methods. So we're going to do an X and we're going to do a Y. All right. When you finally finish the function, we have to have a colon. Okay. All right. So first thing that we're going to do is all we're going to do is we are going to do create a new variable. Okay. And we're going to call this answer. And we are going to do answer equals X plus y pretty simple then we are going to return answer so what return does is it allows you to send whatever answer is outside of the program and that's it now when we run it and I'm running this like this because I want to make sure that you guys understand this okay you need to understand this enter a number 12, enter another number, 23, and nothing happens, okay? Biggest mistake when doing functions is when you create the function and you try to run it and nothing happens. I've seen it so many times. The answer here is that you have to run the function. So we are going to, not down here, we're going to do it up here, we have to run the function. So adding and what another common mistake that people do is they do x comma y okay and we don't know what x and y is because x is not defined okay the deal here is that this now becomes number and number two this okay is being substituted for this so what's going to happen is number one, whatever number you enter up here is going to be put here and it's going to be put here. Whatever number two is that you put up here is going to be put here and put here. When we run this, we will now ask for our numbers. It still won't work. Okay. You need to print your function if you want to see what is going on. Run it one more time. And one final problem that we have. We 
did not make these inputs because, and like I've said a hundred times, user input by itself comes in as a string. So here we go. And finally, we're going to get it to run the right way. And the answer is 24. Okay? That's how this works. That's how this works. This is what you need to do. When you work on your silly sentence project, this is the key right here. All right? That's how you make a function. Thank you.